Today, I just want to share a video with you that is unbelievable. This is going to be of an 11 year old boy from Austria. He's a big fan of my YouTube channel and has been following certain things and trying to duplicate the exercises that I've put on YouTube. Now, the exercises that Klaus, the 11 year old boy, has been working on and <laughs> duplicating are very high level skills. Now, let me say, how high level are they? Very few professional dog trainers can do and accomplish the exercises or know how to do these exercises that Klaus is doing here in the video. So I just put up a video, a series of videos, probably within the last three weeks of a black German Shepherd named Axel teaching him how to bark on command at a ball because he's preparing for protection work. So I went through all the exercises of staying at the leg under control and holding himself with no leash on and him barking at it without going at it and bringing the ball to him or letting him go to the ball on cue when he's told. So this is not an easy exercise. This takes a lot of self-control and discipline <laughs> from the dog to hold that position with nothing restraining him and talk to the ball in frustration and when he's told and wait for the ball to be given to him or to be released to it. Very difficult, like I explained in those videos, how hard it is to do. And not only that, all the exercises here, I'm going to show you first the exercises that we did on YouTube and then Klaus doing the exercise with his dog in Austria. And then here, very difficult exercise of having the dog follow your body in a circle around the ball and the dog being talking to the ball and focusing on what they want most and having to hold that leg sideways in a circle is the hardest thing a dog can do while being focused at it and talking to the ball in a circle and hold that leg as best they can and not jump out for the ball out of frustration and continue to hold it and wait until they're told to get the ball. Right. 
very difficult exercise. An 11 year old Klaus <laughs> does it beautifully <laughs> with his Doberman. Beautifully. I mean, we're talking high level stuff that this 11 year old boy is doing that most dog trainers on the planet cannot do. It's amazing. So the next exercise was the walking backwards. Having the dog stay at your leg and moving backwards while the dog talks to the ball and holds the leg straight back until released to get the ball. And then here, Klaus decides to throw a double whammy into the mix. So you'll see him come out here into his kitchen and do circling and then reverse. So he added two exercises, circling and reverse walking before he let his dog have the ball. Getting even more complicated right and more advanced combining methods I mean, it's unbelievable. So this 11 year old boy <laughs> from just watching my YouTube channel was able to achieve very high level exercises of discipline self-control on his two year old Doberman. It's very impressive. So I had to put this video up giving, honoring Klaus as an 11 year old boy for achieving such high level exercises. Amazing. Now here, Klaus's dad, you'll hear his voice in the video. I had put up a video of a pit bull that I taught how to go walk backwards away from us and spin down the hallway and come in reverse back to us. Spin. Spin. Yes. Back. Back. Spin. First. And here you'll see Klaus duplicate that exercise with the Doberman. And here Klaus throws in also Dad Klaus <laughs> walking backwards in reverse doing down, sit, reverse, so reversing the dog and throwing commands in as the dog goes in reverse away from him. 
zurück, Platz, Sitz, zurück, Platz, Sitz, zurück, Sitz, hier. I have a video of my Golden Retriever that I put up years ago. I'm assuming that he was basing it on this video. Back. Down. They sit. Back. Down. They come. Sit. They back. Down. They come. Sit. Down. It's very good. Right, so you got to give props to Klaus and Klaus Jr. I mean, amazing, and they're not professionals. They don't do dog training for a living. It's just their pet. So, you got to give them a hand, right? It's very good, and the stuff that Klaus Jr. is showing there is very elite stuff again that most professional dog trainers can't even do so hats off <laughs> to both klaus and klaus jr very good job so want to share this because when people send me things if they take time to work on things i'm more than happy to put stuff up on my channel if they've taken the time to do them execute them well I'm all game for putting somebody's stuff up if they've taken the time to do that so bravo Klaus Klaus Jr till next time Miami Dog Whisperer